You are now watching Koki. Winter Lookbook and Wish List. Yo guys, what's up? I didn't see you there. My name is Nick, aka Koki. Today we are in my winter lookbook slash haul slash wish list video. I feel like even though retail spending has gone down for the entire world, sort of, I think, while yes, like less people can go out, less people can make money to buy clothing and stuff, I can imagine a lot of you guys, my viewers, going through retail therapy to make themselves feel better during the lockdown. While yeah, like you don't have many places to go out and wear your outfits, you know, even vibing at home, wearing your outfit in your bedroom, listening to music. That's a vibe. That's a thing. During all these outfits, I'll tell you guys and show you guys that you don't need a lot of pieces to make a wide variety of outfits, especially if you're just getting into fashion, starting with basics, like just a few things from Uniqlo, even though I won't be showing anything from Uniqlo, but mixing and matching is your BF fucking F. Also, I'll try my best to link everything in the description. You are now watching Koki. Lookbook slash try on. So this outfit's actually been one of my favorite outfits. I've been wearing it a lot. It's the British Thunder t-shirt with the Flaneur Home Wax Denim. I'm sure you guys have been seeing, but flared denim, flared pants, just everywhere. But these ones that I have on me right now are skinny all the way up until the very end. Really, this bootcut slash flare trend, I think, creates a really nice dynamic between pants and shoe that, you know, people just weren't doing before. Before it came back into style. These wax denim single-handedly made me decide to go out and buy two new pair of shoes to wear with them. So the new shoes I copied were the Air Max 90s in all black. Before these Air Max 90s, Koki was wearing black Air Force 1s. It's not so much the memes against black Air Force 1s that made me want to switch out, but I was just kind of done with the black Air Force 1s. This was something different. Converse Feng Chen Wang collabs. These Converse Feng Chen Wang high tops are beautiful. And this whole idea, I think, of a shoe inside a shoe is amazing. It's a, another way to make a shoe chunky, really. And on the topic of flared denim, I want to show you guys these other pair of pants that I purchased from my friend Victor. These were a pair of custom Levi's that he made flared and did a beautiful job with these details on it. Like even if I wore these with just a black hoodie on the top, the subtle detailing at the end of the leg does a really nice job of pulling the outfit together. I threw him in here and I'm going to throw his page in the description as well because I want you guys to consider buying things from DIY artists. And I'm not talking about myself, like my DIY things are... These artists making custom clothing, I think, is the next level. Next one we got is this oversized puffer with a Jun Inigawa X nightclub t-shirt. You guys ask about this t-shirt a lot and yep, there it is, Jun Inigawa nightclub. I've been knowing and following Jun Inigawa for a couple years now and he makes very beautiful anime graffiti type art. And then him being able to put his work onto clothing, like, damn. That's just exotic, that's beautiful, it's fire. So again, comboing this with an oversized black puffer jacket. I know a lot of you guys are gonna ask where this one is from too, and I'm so sorry, but I cannot ID this for you. There literally is no ID on it. I purchased this one from Japan, but literally everywhere, including like Aritzia. Dude, honestly, go to H&M, you can probably find it. Uniqlo probably has a lot of puffer jackets too, so. With this outfit, I'd probably be pairing it with wax denim, but you know, this isn't a wax denim lookbook, so I gotta change it up. zip ups okay let's talk a little bit about zip ups i think zip ups right now boom 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 the way like give me the choice between a hoodie and a zip up and i'll take the zip up right now with zip up hoodies right now it's definitely part of the trend with the whole flared look and this y2k aesthetic compared to a hoodie even you can actually show off your graphic t-shirt whether you got it fully like chest open stomach showing halfway zipped up or all the way to the top just to feel comfy And this other zip up hoodie is from Blue Boy slash Wanted Apparel. If you want to cop this for yourself and all your friends, have a little Nerf war battle, I think that'd be amazing. So these pieces were sent to me from VHNY who also sponsored a portion of this video. So shout out to them. They, of course, shout out to them, what the hell? 
they actually gave us you guys a discount code that we can use so check that out below for 30 percent off there's actually just super beautiful pieces here so this first one this blazer check it out I chose this piece from them because I don't have a casual blazer really and the reason I call this one a casual blazer is because of the little cutouts right there. It looked like it sort of ripped apart even, you know, if anything a distressed blazer. But it's like a clean distress because imagine wearing this with a loud popping t-shirt and just having a little bit of that pop out. You guys saw me wear this in my last video, I had someone ask me where do I get my basic hoodies. These aren't exactly basic with their logos behind it, but regardless for the logo because they chose a tonal color, it is pretty subtle and I still would consider this a blank that you could pick up. And because it is December, it's cold, it's the winter, they did throw a jacket in here too, a reversible jacket. My favorite side of this reversible jacket being the duotone Sherpa layer. And then the other side is a waterproof layer, which is nice when it's raining. Check out that discount code below. below. Wrapping up this lookbook portion, here are my top three most worn necklaces. First up, the Misbehaved Pearl Necklace. I love this one. Pearls are kind of on its own level and they achieve something that silver or gold jewelry can't. Snake climbing on a chain necklace by Blockhead. And a Vivian Westwood bat chain. Santa wish list. Moving on to my grails now, my wish list. Um, I'm gonna show you guys some things that you guys might be able to buy in place of me. So you guys know I have my Air Max 90s now, which are my new black pair of shoes. And I have those Converse high tops, which are sort of like my new boots. But I even want both of those pair of shoes combined into a look itself. So here it is. Converse All-Star Extra High Platform. So I was debating between the orange pair of shoes I got and these ones. These pair of shoes are a lot more versatile. And I think if you don't have any high tops yourself, you might consider going for these ones instead. And then these apps Aslo, these as what are these called? These Aslo Shark Shoe Converses. No, these are not Converses. They just look like Converses. I think the black pair is really clean, and this is another case of subtle loud with the very subtle coloring but loud silhouette. And then here we have the Skull Club Striped Cardigan by Cambrichetti, which is another brand I talked about before, and I love this brand. Unfortunately, this cardigan is sold out. They do have some other sweaters on their website, but this cardigan, I think is still my grail and I'll probably be eyeing it for the next couple months. And also by them are these brainwashed brown distressed denims. This reddish brown is something I don't have anywhere in my closet. And they also got the flared finish to them, which would be perfect for all these new pair of shoes that I just bought. And let me just throw one more pair of pants from them in there, these leather patch skull pants, insane. And if you guys are looking for like your own pair of affordable boot cut pants, Aslo also sells a very nice basic and you can kind of see like a lot of Instagram influencers wearing these ones. Thank you for watching. My name is Nick. I make DIY clothing slash talk about fashion slash talk about life. Um, yo, happy holidays too, guys. I don't think there'll be another video before Christmas. So happy holidays, whatever you celebrate, even if you don't celebrate, just stay safe. Yo, guys, have a good life. Adios. Bye-bye. Hey, yo, if you need any help, if you need to ask me any questions, if you just want some advice about clothing, I'm not smart at all. If you want to like flame me even, yo, Nick, your opinions, and go ahead and send me a DM. I read all DMs because I love you guys and that's it. That's all. Okay, bye-bye.